Hey everyone, it's Stefan Schoenfelder, Dakota Ironworks. Hope you're all doing well. Want to kind of talk about what I think is important for equipment uh, in a welding and fabrication shop, whether you're in a 100 by 100 building or a maybe 12 by 30 ish. So, aside from your obligatory fire extinguisher, welding machine, torch, grinder, and fire extinguisher, the most important thing to me is my table. So let's take a quick little tour of my table. So this is a 4x8 sheet on a frame that's roughly an inch, inch and a half bigger all around. Made out of 2x2 two two square tube. Two and a half inch square tube going down to the fixed wheels here and the casters over there. You got two by two inch ribs underneath. And let's go to a corner here. So in this corner, I've got a great spot for a ground. I've got a spot to rest my grinder, a hook that I honestly don't even use that much, and a great place to sharpen my soapstone. Uh, this is just a little piece of DOM welded on here so I can bend stuff, and I kind of made this little hook deal that rests on there to hold my leads or whatever I need. Uh, when I built this table quite a while ago, all I could afford was quarter inch plate for the top. You can see she's pretty humped up and bowed, so she can go three eighths, half, whatever, do it. Otherwise, you can make this work. What I did when I started doing a lot of handrails was realized how unlevel my floor is, as well as how bowed my tabletop is, so I built this leveling system on here. These are just two three quarter inch nuts welded to the table. This nut here is free, that's a jam nut. This nut here is welded to a piece of three quarter all thread that just runs through those top two nuts. And then I've got this piece here, three by three by three eighths, Somewhere there's a set screw here, Allen head set screw. All I did was drill this out with a three quarter inch bit so it drops on there. Now that's adjustable and I've got them in every corner. So basically you can get this level with this. I take a piece of that 4x4 four four, uh, aluminum tubing, I can lay it across these pads, get it level, and then level to the other side. When they're not in use, I also made a couple of plugs, just some 3 quarter inch round bar with a washer welded to it that I can just drop in to protect the threads on the top two nuts. I also made some shelves underneath out of expanded so to not catch debris, flammable debris especially. I've got a little spot for a pure argon tank and a TIG welder. And I've got a little spot to hold all my clamps. And that is just piece of angle welded up behind this tube and a piece of probably three-quarter round over to this leg yeah I guess that's all I got to say about my table so let's visit again soon about stuff you need in the shop have a good night